Well, head coach Jack Biggs coached three games to one over a very good ledger team in the, um, I guess, the finals or an ECC championship or something along those lines. It's It's been an odd year with the COVID and whatnot, but first of all, talk about how your team played tonight. Sure. First, you know, again, a championship or another game or whatever you want to call it, we were just super excited to be able to play again through uh, part of November. Uh, kudos to Ledger and what they have done with their program. They're an amazing team, and, and the coaches have done a really nice job with those those players over there. And, again, we're just excited to be out here on the floor tonight playing. I know that a lot of teams didn't have that opportunity to play, uh, so I guess just to have that that chance to be out here and prove ourselves one last time meant right. a ton for not only our, our team but all the seniors too as well. Now, we talked a little bit off air, and you Sometimes coaching volleyball can be a bit of a roller coaster ride. We saw the ups and downs here tonight. Um, you know, where did you guys find the energy in that fourth game to kind of put things away a little bit? Well, I think, you know, you kind of hit on the head there. It's it's a little bit of a psychology. It's a little bit of a mo right. momentum. You, you want to ride your momentum swings and then kind of battle through the when, when we have those lows. So we were able to do that. We made a couple adjustments. We started running our middle a lot more, made a couple substitutions defensively, and it kind of went our way. And then, obviously, we gained momentum, and we were trying to run with that. You know, you guys have gone, what, two weeks without school. Uh, you've been hybrid learning. You've had the season shut down at times. You know, you finished 9-1 this year. I think your record was overall. You know, if you look back to, say, I'm talking about my mask here. If you look back to, say, September to where we're at right now, how would you define or how would you summarize the season? Oh, what a, what a roller coaster. That's a loaded question. Yeah, that's a loaded question. But what a roller coaster uh, season. You know, we, we start out. And we didn't even know if we were going to have a season. And then right. all of a sudden, they're like, yes, you can start 30 minutes, 60 minutes. We're training inside, outside on the tennis course, conditioning. And the girls the whole time with masks on never complained. I'm sure that was with every single school because they were very excited just to have the opportunity to play. Um, as we got going in the first match, we're like, oh, this is great. And right. then all of a sudden, we had to pump the brakes and go off for two weeks and then come back. And then a little bit, a little bit of time, we got our swagger back a little bit. Um, and then we lost a few girls this week that got pulled out. So, but, you know, kudos to this team to, to stick together, act like a team, be really mature, and, again, have a chance to play the, the, uh, the last possible date that you can play volleyball on. So. so, with everything said, you're proud of your girls tonight, proud of them for the season ahead. Absolutely. I'm proud of all the girls. I'm proud of all the seniors who had to stick through this um, in, in all the sports. Um, super excited about having my coaches here tonight and, and being able to do that. Some former players cheering us on. So, yeah, it's a great feeling. Uh, I'm, I'm very proud of all the way that these guys handled themselves for the past eight weeks. Stay healthy. Congratulations. And hopefully I will see you on the baseball field. Thank you. Great job tonight, Coach. Thank you.